<laughs> hey, um, it's gonna be like really loud for a few minutes. The game audio is blaring for whatever reason. And we gotta be loud for, again, whatever reason. At least till we can situate this shit. Situate this. Yeah. <laughs> Live with your mistakes. Judge me. I don't care. Don't, don't, don't pay attention to that. I've never played this game before. Oh yeah. By the way, it's a game called Coffee Talk. <laughs> it's a nice little game where you are a barista. Yes, you're a barista. You talk to your customers. They all have their own diverse stories. It's a nice little world. Yeah. Do you need help? Yes. <laughs> Name the barista. <laughs> Uh, What's cool, little Timmy? Not Timmy. Uh, Sturgill. Sturgill. I don't know. That was just the first thing that came to mind. I said (laughs) Sturgill. That is Sturgly. (laughs) Sturgly. Yeah. (laughs) transition into <laughs> into <laughs> the rest of the video. It was a very nice audio transition. Thank you. <laughs> I can do a twinkling stars if you want. Twinkle, twinkle, twinkle. Okay, so for those of you <laughs> that have skipped past and got to this part, hello, this is where the game starts. I am Bo. Welcome to Coffee Talk. We're a barista and we get to talk to people and learn their stories with some nice relaxing music. It's gonna be nice. Nice little relaxing game. So what the fuck are we playing? Sturgle, you're already you Sturgle. You can be Sturgle. <laughs> it's actually Sturgly. Okay, you know what? Seattle 2020. False 2022. Okay. A city filled with dreams and madness. A time when the great war between races is but a footnote in history. A time when anyone can dream of being whatever they want to be. False. The American dream isn't real. Of course it's not yet. They slept. Exactly. Wait. Yeah, now shut the fuck up. (laughs) 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 And have those dreams crushed before they can even be discussed. But still, it is a place and time where anything can happen. She still hasn't opened that pineapple juice, by the way. She wouldn't want to do it for recording. <laughs> it is when the elves have left the forest to build their startups. When the dwarves have emerged from their caves to start their automotive empires. Oh, that's a little scary. Not gonna lie, that guy with the, um, the short hair. And the, the blue jacket, and, you know, little, the three buttons. I I've always wanted a jacket like that because like I like that style. But he looks like a fuckboy. like a really really big douchey fuckboy. He looks like an incoming JoJo. <laughs> incoming JoJo. <laughs> Sells the orc behind him his stand. I guess. Just your look. It's the girl next to me. <laughs> That's that's his true feelings inside. That's great. That's fucking great. (laughs) When the orcs have put down their axes and started using computers to improve their lives. And when he 
humans live among them as driven as ever. It is a city that holds the many dreams and stories of its people. In other words, this is what Skyrim would, Skyrim would be like if, if uh, there weren't racism and they were modern. You think they got guns? No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they made guns before they made computers, so I assume they had guns at that point. <laughs> most of these star- stories. Stories. Most of these stories <laughs> are left untold. What? My mind buffered for a second. <laughs> <laughs> But some few find solace Never in the embrace of bricks and wood and glass. <laughs> Can you not? <laughs> they are told of their drinks, then take up residence in some stranger's memories. Hell yeah. Pop it. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, actually open it. Wait, wait, wait. Do you want help? I'm just gonna pop off their eardrums. Sound warning. You ready for this? Oh yeah. Give me more fucking juice. (laughs) In one corner of the city stands a coffee shop. A place that is only open when the sun is sleeping. I don't think that's a coffee shop. I mean, it can double as a drug den. <laughs> she just have a small little hint. You want a small little hint of Hennessy in your shit? Hey man, you coming around back? I got the good guy. That's a really it's a pub, not a crack house. It's it's still a pub. It's just a secret. It's like a speakeasy. You know that shit that the mobsters and shit used back in the the late what? Come on, you got this. I'm hey. leaving you. What? 70s? Near the Great Depression, it. 70s? 80s? No. Further. 60s? Close enough. 50s? Close enough. 40s? How far back am I gonna fucking go? You're close enough. The 1900s. <laughs> Somewhere in the Is that when these motherfuckers was pulling Tommy guns out? <laughs> and getting syphilis? <laughs> they was getting syphilis since the caveman days. <laughs> when, when did they know they were getting syphilis? Um, when someone grew the intelligence to be like, my my genitals hurt. This shit spread all over my body. Maybe I do have a problem. I'm gonna call it syphilis. Okay. <laughs> where people share their stories and these are their stories oh yeah look at them colors tuesday september 22nd my birthday is on the fourth of that month There was no point in me sharing that. I just wanted to. <laughs> what? Oh, it's you. Say my name. <laughs> wait, wait. It's on auto. How did we not? D- it, what, what, what the fuck's happening? Yeah. Pause. My supplier makes some errors. I don't, I don't have any of my, my ingredients today. We missed quite a bit of dialogue. No, 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 no. That's me. That's mine. There we go. Welcome. Oh, it's you. Don't you want it like not on autoplay? I turned it off. Oh. No, I'm just. You're still being sturgly. I'm still sturgly, but you're afraid. Don't say my name. No, say my name. <laughs> what the fuck does that say? That just says Sturgly. 
You see that? I see a K. S T E R G L I E. Save my fucking name. <laughs> you say it. How's the night so far? We're not continuing. We continue to stay my name. <laughs> because this is an investment. <laughs> so funny. I'm not laughing. What's so funny? Huh? <laughs> also, somewhere within this video, I'm gonna, I'm gonna crack open another thing of pineapple juice, and I'm gonna let y'all just hear it. So, be prepared for it. Hey, I just walked again. Sturgly.
but it seems like the time, it seems like the right time for something bigger. Internet blog? You know, because writing for the paper is kind of stupid. has the task to write a novel. <laughs> That's it's just a short story that with a lot of extra steps. It's a short story with like 300 pages. Yeah. Just stretch it. Then yeah. Or just make it like a collection of short stories. That's not a bad idea. It'd be really easy to do too. Just run out of juice for the first one. Thank you. 
And I'm falling behind on the newspaper's deadlines. That's no point. If the chief finds out, she'll probably kick me out. Ouch. Ouch. I would never fucking say ouch. Again, this is sturdy. I'm not sturdy. I said mine. 
Oh, did I? Oh, yeah, I didn't say mine. Hi. 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 Okay. Sounds like a plan. If you're going to stress yourself out. If you can pull it off. That seems really mean. I mean, you know, just give her confidence. Yeah, just a little bit. I mean, like, they are. I think our stern is realist. Yeah, yeah. Stern is probably a realist. I guess that would correlate a little close to me. Because I'm very blunt and I'm very. Maybe Freya is a fucking procrastinator. Yeah. Yeah, but she's also got like a really good shot for her. So like, I kind of believe her if she said that she was writing stuff and then deleted it all because she felt so conscious about it. I've done that. I like writing. I that shit sucks. I know, I know. You don't need to be so cynical about it. That's the word. That's why I'm here today. Your character's a cynical bitch. Oh. <laughs> I'm hoping to find some inspiration. I wrote some stuff. That does not say stuff. That does not say stuff. Let's try that again. Actually says best. <laughs> I wrote some of my best short stories here, you know. Really? Glad this place could be of service. Did you uh add me in some of them stories? Cause popularity. <laughs> Looks like someone's coming.
okay with this. <laughs> so, you're waiting for your boyfriend? Yes, he should be here soon. I mean, because they're two different people. Yeah, but I feel like she should have that high on as well at the same time. She seems like she I just realized I can't see her. She's pointing at Freya. I mean, I get the feeling that we're going to be seeing a lot of Freya, so... It, I'll just use her with me. Yeah, and then compensate, just give her your regular voice, and then... And then I'll just exercise the heck out of my ability for a Freya videos. Mm -hmm. I wonder how long we're going to be seeing... We didn't get her name, but we'll get her name so. Pink hair, pink face lady. That sounds really racist. I'm sorry. Wow, let's... Let's continue. <laughs> you went from empty to three customers in one night. I thought this place would be more crowded. Considering it's the only coffee shop that's still open after midnight around here. Because it is the only coffee shop that's still open past midnight. And mostly it's empty. Now that you mention it, it's, it is good for business. Having the coffee shop Definitely it's not. It's really not. How the fuck do I stay open? <laughs> Maybe I'm rich and it's just my side hustle. Yup. <laughs> she said. <laughs> I wonder how much we get paid. Then why? I just love doing it. I won't even charge you motherfuckers. I'm, I'm just giving you shit. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> She's a pretty good rider, you know? <laughs>